Welcome back to Texas Eats. Now we're here in Corpus Christi, Texas to go inside of a spot that's serving up all kinds of fresh seafood. Let's go inside Saltwater Grill. Joining us now is Paul Hatridge. He's the owner out here at the restaurant. Thank you so much for having us out here. Great to have you. I mean, we're in Corpus. You gotta have the seafood when you're out here, and you have a wonderful display of all different kinds of seafood goodness. You got golf shrimp, and you got some oysters right here. Right. We're just going in on it. You peel them, yeah. shrimp. That's what it says on the menu. Right. We're just going in on it. I like oh, your yeah. style, Paul. <laughs> you started around. after me, and you Sorry, ate before man. me. I like what's going on. That's the bite. Little you peel them shrimp. around here. <laughs> Oh, good well, That's good. I absolutely love oysters. Yeah. A lot of the horseradish. Yeah. Cocktail sauce on top as well. Yeah, You're some join. people like to slurp those out of the shell. Obviously, you do. I'm, Are you a fork guy? I'm a little more civilized, I think. <laughs> I'm, getting I'm getting outclassed here by Paul. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> Only animals slurp them off the shell, okay? <laughs> Cheers to you. There you go. The shrimp and oysters, a great way to start your meal out here at Saltwater Grill. The shrimp are ready to eat. You've got to peel them yourself, but they're already deveined, ready to rock and roll. And those oysters are absolutely delicious, especially with their house-made cocktail sauce and some horseradish. Talk to me about what's going on with this dish. Yeah, it's a, it's a six ounce sesame tuna uh, coated with black and white sesame seeds. Nice. Uh, quick sear in the pan with some sesame oil. Uh, hit it with some fresh lemon at the end, throw it on the cutting board, slice it up, and you're done. It's That's fantastic. all you need, baby. That sounds good. All right, we're going to go for it. Yeah, we're going to double dip. Well, here. Cheers, sir. Cheers. Tuna. The seared sesame ahi tuna, a very traditional appetizer that you can get. They're doing it right out here. And that aioli on the side mixed up with some of that ponzu sauce is money. It's so clean. It's so simple, and the sesame flavor is very prevalent. I would eat that whole thing. You have the scallops on top, you got the shrimp on there. How popular is this pasta dish? It's really our best selling pasta. It's very rich, tomato -y, a little bit on the spicy side. We call it our Cajun seafood pasta. The uh, shrimp and scallops are lightly dusted and seared off uh, on a hot sear on the on the flat grill. And, and it's just creamy and delicious. I, I love this place. You know what I'm about to say. I know exactly what you're going to say. You guys took the tails off we the did, shrimp did. before you threw it I in mean, the pasta. You can't get your fingers all in the pasta, man. Right? Dude, it's like that. Wow. Cheers. Cheers, man. My goodness. The scallop shrimp Cajun pasta out here is so good. The blackened scallops and shrimp are great textures. They remove the tails for you on the shrimp. I can't tell you how important that is. This is a great dish. That's such your mouth food very, right there. Very popular. Ooh. Mm -hmm. This one right here, this is your special? That is a fresh piece of red snapper that it's slightly blackened, thrown on the flat top and seared. We have a cream sauce, it's got a little Dijon in it, shrimp and crab. Uh, we call it Poncha Train, I think you probably heard that. Yeah. But that's our version of it. It's fantastic. We have customers that uh, request this, even if it's not on the feature board, and we're happy to do it for them. So, <laughs> so I'm gonna excited. get a little shrimp to go with mine. <laughs> I'm not messing around. There you go. There it is, cheers. There you go, cheers. <laughs> But let me tell you, the red snapper dish that they have featured here, absolutely delicious. The sauce that they have on there, the little veggies, the shrimp on top, a really nice dish. That it? sauce is next. I would drink that. <laughs> Give me that instead of this beer and it's down. <laughs> I'm putting it down, baby. This go. is good food. This is a Mahi Mahi, which is a nice vehicle for all different kinds of seasonings and sauces. What are you guys doing with it here? Yeah, a little bit different. So this is something that we sort of created, and it's a mainstay on our menu. Got a little French and a little Gulf of Mexico combination uh, south of the border, if you will. It's got our hollandaise sauce, pico de gallo, fresh avocado, a lot going on in this dish. Fresh garlic, shallots, got a little Tabasco in there, so it's, it's going to kick it up a notch. 
comes a little bit of bright hollandaise sauce that they're making here in-house, and some pico de gallo. And that on top is colorful, it's fun, it's bright, and the acidity matching with that sauce, it just makes for the ultimate bite. You've completely transformed Mahi Mahi here. Saltwater Grill. This is a really fun place to come out here in Corpus. All the food is delicious, and what a fun spot. You can bring the whole family. You got beer on tap, man. You just come out here and enjoy yourself. Grab that beer right there for me, Paul. Thank you so much for having us out here. We're gonna be here a while, baby. I'm gonna eat that whole pasta. Oh, we're drinking it. <laughs>